Kids and we're about to head out to um, Indonesia. We're going to Batan um, for the day. We're going on a boat right now. Uh, Troop says a little bit worried. And the reason why he's a bit worried is because uh, he hates boats. He hates going on the sea. He's scared. Yeah. Straight, I'm scared. I don't give a shit. Straight, I'm scared. You're actually scared? Yeah, man. I'm getting a life jacket until I get on that shit. <laughs> a life jacket? Yeah, blood. You're bringing me in the ocean. Man. You say that. <laughs> hey, man, when in the Mississippi River, I was terrified. Man. That's a river. You're bringing me in the ocean, blood. You're going to be all right, man. You're going to be better all right. Better be all can right. You swim? Of course I can swim. Man. Then what's about that? It's You're the right. ocean, you boy. There's sharks in there, <laughs> Piranhas are them thing there. Are you mad? Even the kids nah, are laughing. Even the kids are laughing. I met, met them laugh, Piranhas. <laughs> nah, fuck that blood. Right, so listen, so we're heading out to um, Bataan. Gonna be going out now to catch the ferry to go over there and uh, we'll be in Indonesia. So uh, looking forward to this mad support for Arsenal in Indonesia. So um, let's hope we come see a couple of gooners out there. Don't take the fucking piss, you know. Big man, too. Don't take the fucking piss, 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 Don't take the 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 piss, Don't take I'm being serious, you know what mine is? What? Tottenham winning the league. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You know when he gets vexed? It. Look at him, he's all vexed. He, he doesn't he want to talk to nobody. Now. You watch how quiet he'll be on that boat. <laughs> <laughs> it's a joke, yeah? You have to make it a joke. Alright, alright. Now, round joke. Now, round joke. Watch him get on the step. <laughs> I'm not feeling this block. I'm not feeling this at all. No, not one bit blood, this is bullshit, bro. I couldn't be flying, bro. I would have flown, bro. That would have been cool, bro. I like planes. I don't like boats, bro. I'm going on a fucking cruise, but now nah, I'm good still. Singapore is definitely a place that you could live. I mean, especially as I'm um, somebody from England because it's so. So, uh, well, there's so many English people here, so many, the, the people speak the language, so it's a very easy place to live. The weather's great. Humid, but great. The people are great, it's friendly, it's, it's, um, not, it's a very peaceful place. That was until DT turned up, but I, <laughs> I'd live here. <laughs> this guy's a mug. Look at that It's nice, man. Better than Luton. <laughs> Marshall Flats, man. Yeah. <laughs> Pay <deal>. My, <laughs> Lee Bank. My God. Beautiful country, man. It's amazing. I mean, not, like, the I architecture started, as well. People wouldn't think that I know about architecture. People wouldn't think I know how to even say it. I can't pronounce some players' names, let alone architecture. But no, it's beautiful. I'm loving it. The beat. We are now officially in Indonesia. Uh, Troops is gone. Troops is gone. I can't work out why he's so scared of water. How does he have a bath? <laughs> <laughs> does he like put armbands on in the bath and a life raft? Starts floating around in his bath like panicking. <laughs> no, no. It's, it's too deep. 
Let some out. Oh man, I don't know what's up with this guy, man. He, and it, you know, you know what? It was such a smooth ride across there. The sea weren't choppy at all. It's a really nice boat. So anyway, we're here, Indonesia. How much does that boat cost you? Shut up. So listen, in Indonesia, right? I've just changed up some money, right? And for all those people who are always saying, yeah, Robbie's rich, I am now. In my hand, I have 712,000. I don't know if it's dollars. Yeah. 712,000, I'm rich. By the way, that's 40 pounds in English money what I just changed up. It's ridiculous, 17,800 Indonesian dollars or whatever the money is to one pound. Wow, I'm rich. We're just looking up on uh, Indonesia. It's an incredible country. 17,504 islands in Indonesia. That's amazing. It's basically, it's a load of islands on the sea that collectively come together and form one country. It's amazing. Um, and what's the population? Uh, I think I'm, I'm uh, 261, they said in 2016. But there are a lot of people living in the island, not counted for. Yeah, two. The they, they imagine having to do, 261 million, imagine having to do a census over it with so many islands. Troops couldn't do it, that's for sure. <laughs> There'd be too many, you know how many boats you'd have to take to do that census. <laughs> <laughs> you couldn't do it, troops. But uh, yeah, wow, amazing country, amazing. Are these miserable lot, DT and troops, typical English boys, you know what I mean? Ordering chips. Uh, look, we're right by the sea, right next to the sea here in Indonesia. Boats coming in all the time with seafood and they're ordering chips. Oh, yeah. Right. So okay. look, they show you here what fish you're gonna get. So it's in prawns, man. Those are some big prawns. Huge prawns. Huge fish. I feel a bit evil now. We're going to be eating some of these soon. <laughs> What's your name? Ivan. Ivan. Yeah. Hey, Ivan. Ivan. No, no, not Ivan, yeah. Hey. Not the Hamro Gazidas, yeah. <laughs> just a certified no, Ivan. Ivan Gazidas, yeah. You understand? He's come, he heard we were coming to Batam and he's come and greeted the man them. And he's given me a key ring with my name on it, bro. And me. And Robbie. And DT. But that is sick, fam. Yeah, it's got that like, Batam guy. Island on it. Yeah, it's special. You know what I mean? Thank you. Bamboo. I appreciate that. Yep. Thank you. Yeah. Right, it's one of them ones that was in the tank here. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Robbie just literally picked someone's death wish. That poor fish, he went, You! See you, yeah? Push out Robbie, gonna munch you. Yes! Proper fish. What's his name? Proper fish, man. Fresh. Love it. Eating chips, chicken wings. That whole lunch you can see there, the, the remnants of it, right? That cost one million Indonesian dollars, or whatever it is, right? Which probably works out to be about fifty pound. That's about ten pound each. I'm telling you, in England, one of those fishes alone would probably be like at least twenty, thirty pound alone. That is included all of our drinks. I mean, it's so cheap. Um, wow. And good. Full up. Look how, look how, look, look. Why, why are you trouble the fish? Look how cool they are. Look at them. Look. Look how cool they are. Living life. Living my best life. And then you come with your fucking self and dump you the fish. The poor fish fly. I've got to get in this one. This is like fast and furious. Man's getting my Toretta on. <laughs>
the beat. here in Batam, in Indonesia. As you can probably see, I don't know if you was, uh, when you was in the car, but we were in a different taxi. It's a lot different to, um, a lot different to Singapore. Um, a lot more built up. Kind of reminds me a bit like Jamaica. A minute ago we drove the open gully and stuff like that. Kind of really put me in the mind of um, Jamaica, but and, um, there's a lot of people here. But I like it, man, I like the vibe here. And uh, yeah, you know, it's good to get down to these, uh, these parts of the world, you know, Indonesia, it's a huge country. And um, it's only a shame that we're just kind of passing through. I don't like to have spent like a few days there, but um, yeah, we're still scoping it out. These guys are getting gas at the moment, there's a trainer shop in here. Um, so yeah, just taking a look around, man. How are you buying? Don't worry about what I buy. Yeah. You'll find out when I send you the bill. You get it. <laughs> Deal with your own bill, man. You know what I mean? Deal with your own bill, bro. Your own bill. Your own bill. Can't wait to go home now, you know. Get back to Singapore and then start our journey home. I'm actually looking forward to it. Can't wait to get home, see the family, man. Back to England, see the family. Then it's on to Sweden. I know, it's been a bit crazy these past few weeks. Russia, Singapore, Indonesia, Ireland, Sweden. I'm blessed, man. I'm really grateful for this. And it's great to get to all these places and meet so many football fans, so many Arsenal fans. And um, it's just been a wonderful summer so far. And uh, let's hope the team can continue that wonderful summer. It was like what I saw on this tour from the Arsenal team. Not so much um, even the performances, but what I liked about the team was the unity and the harmony and the, the fact that it looks like they're all pulling together. I'm really infused. It's fucking bad. Oh, fuck. It's only half hour. I know, man, but Bren, you know, I don't like these fucking bolts, bro. You're done alright. Just bust the headphones on, listen to tunes, you're fine. Pray for me again, man, please. Man. If you love me, you pray for me, blood. <laughs> the beat. Why is the team moving like that, bro? You might end up like that. Because the man's turning the boat. Why is he turning the boat like that? Because he's coming into dock. Nah, don't turn the boat like that. <laughs> is he mad? I lick him down, you know? I fling him in the sea, bro. Like. Yeah, but you'll be joining him, innit? No, I won't. You'll be like Leonardo DiCaprio. You're nuts. I'm not saving Kate. Jack! Don't let go! Hey, right, so what's her name? <laughs> What's her name in the film? Because her name's Kate Winslet. But what's her name in the film? Rose. I ain't Rose. saying, I ain't saying Rose. <laughs> Rose is drowning. Trust me. <laughs> Rose is drowning, blood. I, I don't business, fam. You know what I said? Rose, you're dead? Yeah, man. Why you laughing? It's not amusing. It's not amusing. 
Huh? The boat. You scared, you scared, boy. I am sailing. <laughs> Fucking ham rock. Boy. Boat and rock. So, after the video that you post to me, right? Yeah. A lot of people like came to me like from Tanzania, from Zimbabwe, from Nigeria, from all over the world. Yeah. Say, oh, I admire your love for, for Arsenal, your passion for Arsenal. Please come to my country. I want you to come to my country. Oh. And they were asking you, please Bobby, get Philip to London now. ASAP. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yes, I will save some money, I will come. You guys and yes, yes, you guys yes, and, yes. and come to Highway, and catch the Arsenal. Amen. Yes. This is gesture of uh, promotion. Thank you so much for coming to Singapore. Thank you. Two nice. Two nice is kind of. No mean. This is people around the world, probably. You know what I mean, people. He didn't have to do this. He didn't have to do this, man. You know what I mean, and, uh, the guy's heart. He's got a wonderful heart, this guy, man. Um, respect. Thank you. Troops don't cry. Please, Billy! Billy! Don't leave me! I know he ain't gonna cry. Have a sip, like. Thank you. Like, come on, man. This got Come on, This is the way be yourself, bro. This is mad. Right, yes. <laughs> it's mad. <laughs> so, we're about to get on the flight. Just got ourselves some provisions. And, um, listen, you know what? I've got to say something, right? British Airways. Fuck British Airways. <laughs> fuck British Airways, isn't it? Yeah? Man's coming for your blood clot, yeah? You want to fuck with a man then? I've got something for you, lot, you know? Go on now, Robbie. I was going to say in a bit of a nicer way. Nah, fuck that. <laughs> Straight to the point, man. Oh. You know me. Slow down. Yeah, you know what? We feel con, man. But you know what? We came on a flight and we paid over a, over a thousand pounds each for these tickets. And then on the way back, on the way down, we had a baggage allowance. On the way back now, they're saying, we've got no baggage allowance and have charged us 80 odd dollars each. Nice. Let's put our bags on the plane. Rip off. And, uh, I, I, I've never had this yet, ever, on any flight. And, you know, I do a lot of flights, so we're going to be making a complaint about it. So British Airways sort it out, man. What's this all about? I thought this was a big airline, man. They're operating like some little budget thing. And this is a long haul 13 hour flight. So, but anyway, not going to make that spoil the trip. It's it was been amazing. A, it's been an amazing trip. Love Singapore, I'd definitely come back here. I'd love to come here for that Grand Prix. Yeah. Oh, I'd love to come here for that Yo, Grand Prix. Yo, big up Amir. Big up Bull Deep. Amir. Big up Philip. Bull Deep, Philip, these guys. Hella love. Marley. Marley, my yeah, brother. Some you of these guys know. really helped make this a great trip as well. Mm. Um, you know, th these guys, they wouldn't even make us put a hand in our pocket. Nah, fam, it was madness, bro. They were, they were unbelievably friendly, mm. man. Like, this is such a beautiful country. Beautiful people. Love Singapore. We'll be back. Back again! <laughs>